Look, I don't want any trouble. I don't like you, and I don't like your radio. What you gonna do about it? You tell him. Now here's another. Solo. I'm just. I'm, I'm only here for a drink. Oh, what's wrong? Not so tough once you're not on the air. Hey there, pal. What? What? What's this about? Oh, it's you. I'm here to give you a hand. I, I, I mean, I'm not really looking to cause, you know, trouble. I don't... I have no idea what I did to deserve this. I just wish they'd go away. Come on, man. Take a stand. Don't chicken out here. I, I don't think I, I could uh, do that thing that you're describing. <laughs> With these men, it could, well, it, it, it could turn violent. Nothing will change unless you make it happen. It's not that bad. I can just, I can just, I can just deal with this. Don't worry. I've got your back. Well, if you think it would work. Okay, that's, well, that's enough. Oh, I'm sorry. You say something. I said, I said, that's enough. Leave me alone. <laughs> Look at you. Hmm, let me think about that for a second. Hmm, nah, I don't think so. I, I mean it. Leave me alone. Well, sounds like you were thinking about saying, or else. <laughs> were you, Travis? Were you gonna say, or else? I'm wondering what comes after that. What you gonna do, little man? Uh, I'll beat you up! Big mistake, Travis. I'm gonna destroy you and your friend here. Help! Security! Call security! Help! Security! We need security out here! Get lost. Um, hi. There. Hey, Vadim. What the hell is wrong with you? You were supposed to help Travis in fight, not murder people in my bar. Why would you think this is okay? Totally deserved it. Those guys were assholes. Of course they were assholes. That was the whole point. <sighs> I will try and fix the situation which you have made messing of. In meantime, I need you to not kill anyone and help with the rest of plan. Okay? You have seen Scarlet, yes? She has worked here for some time. Now, I am just simple bartender, but I see things. I see how Travis looks at her. And I see that sometimes she looks at him. If someone who was not her employer suggests that she go spend time with Travis, it might do him some good. I could have a chat with her. <laughs> yes, I know. This is why I'm telling you. Apparently, I also need to say, please do not be killing anyone. Okay? This is for helping Travis, not murdering for fun. Just do whatever it takes to get her to agree to see Travis, and this will all be worth it. And you and I never talked about this, all right? What, you lost? I ain't a tour guide.
Miss? I'm on a break right now. Can I ask you something personal? It's about Travis. Travis? Really? Did he... Did he mention me? Uh, I heard about the fight. Travis was... Well, he was brave. Yeah? Absolutely. You should really pay him a visit. You think? I mean, I've definitely noticed him. Maybe... No. No, I couldn't just go over there. What are you so nervous about? What's the worst that can happen? Believe me, I can think of some pretty horrible things. Look, I'm just not ready for that. Look, Travis is a nice guy. I can tell that you like him. And I think he likes you. Just go talk to him. Okay, I will. I'll go see him now. Thanks. Busy man, I've got things to do, people to see. If I didn't know better, I could have sworn I saw you in the here in Diamond City. Ever been up in the stands? Let's just say they can afford hey, a lot of things. This is terrible. Oh, I knew it. I knew it. He was up to no good, and look what's happened now. You've got to help. I can't do it. You've got to help me. Take it easy. It'll be all right. Just tell me what happened. They took him. They took Vadim. Men came in. They said they were friends of the ones you killed. It said Vadim owed them money because of what happened. He, he wouldn't pay, and then they grabbed them and said that they would make him pay. And then they just dragged him out. You have to do something. Please tell me you can do something. I'll bring him back, Yefim. Count on it. Please, just bring him back. He's an idiot, but he's my brother. I'd go with you, but someone has to stay here. Talk to Travis. Maybe he knows where they took him. Just another day in the Commonwealth, am I right? So it's true then? You're leading the Minutemen? Good for you. Great cause. Do all you outside of wear such funny clothes? But Dad says not to talk to strangers. Hey there. What's going on? I need your help. The Dean's been kidnapped by friends of Bull. That's not funny. Ugh. You think this is a joke. Well, it's not. I'm serious. <laughs> Wait, what? Really? Oh. Oh, man. Wow. Is this... This is because of what happened, isn't it? It's... It's my fault. Look, the Deans had dealings with those guys before. Why they took him doesn't matter. Getting him back does. You're right. We've got to get him back. Look, I don't, I don't really, I mean, I don't have a lot of friends. If Vadim is missing or in trouble or whatever, then I'm going to help get him back.
It's probably going to be dangerous. I expect things will get ugly. I'm not... I, I'm not stupid. I know that. I've heard enough to know they'll probably hold up at the old Beantown Brewery. We've got to go in there, show them we mean business, and, and then we can bring Vadim back, and everything will be okay. Right? I'll... I'll get a gun, and I'll meet you there. We'll settle this. I'm on a break right now. Nothing there now. What do you think? I don't know. I'm jumping in shadows. Yeah, you're probably right. Gotta cut down on the jet, I guess. Now don't start talking crazy! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I didn't know if anyone would come. I thought perhaps this is the end. Oh, thank you, thank you. You are true friend. Are there more of them? Are they gonna come after you again? No, no. This was best they could do. You got them. <laughs> These idiots had caps and chems just lying around. <laughs> they. They did not notice when I filled my pockets. You deserve what I took. Ah, and Travis, I am surprised to see you here. <laughs> hey, Vadim. I'm glad you're safe. How did you get roped into this? I, I wasn't forced or anything. I wanted to help. <laughs> you are full of surprises, my friend. Man. What a day, huh? Hey, listen. 
I wanted to say thanks. This has been, well, it's been crazy. But I've learned a lot, I think. You came through it all pretty well, Travis. That's good to hear. Thanks. After all this, I think about the things that had me worried so much, and it just seems silly, you know? Like, was I really that worried about just being on the radio? That's nothing compared to being beaten up, shot at. I can do so much more. And I need to. Anyway, thanks again. I owe you.